Let's talk about activated charcoal and its uses. Stay tuned. What's up guys, hope everyone's been doing well. For those of you who don't know, my name is Edgeman and I'm a pharmacist and I enjoy making these videos about common questions patients have about medications or any healthcare related topic. So make sure you subscribe for more content. Now to the rest of the video. Activate charcoal is a fine black powder that can be purchased over the counter at any pharmacy. Now its main use is to help treat poisoning and this includes poisoning from Tylenol or acetaminophen aspirin, as well as like barbiturates, theophylline, as well as uh, phenytoin. Um, it's not really that effective against treating poisoning from alcohol, iron, or any other like charged chemical agents. However, there is a lot of talk about activated charcoal. I've been hearing from different sources and people have been asking me about whether or not it's effective against cleansing your body of toxins. And so in this video, we'll talk about how activated charcoal works and as well as does it make sense of, of its use for treating um, or cleansing your body. It is effective for treating certain types of poisoning and we'll get into that, but we'll also talk about whether or not it's effective against like a holistic approach. And as a disclaimer, before taking activated charcoal to treat a poison situation or to treat a poison overdose, uh, make sure to call poison control. I'll leave their number in, in the description below. Um, they'll give you the recommendation of whether or not to take activated charcoal in that specific poison situation. Um, but as a rule of thumb, let's just make a case. So let's just pretend someone overdosed on acetaminophen or Tylenol, and uh, the, the recommendation is take activated charcoal. So you wanna make sure to take it as soon as possible. Typically it's recommended within uh, less than an hour of exposure to that poison or that toxin. And the reason why is the way that activated charcoal works is it works as an adsorbent meaning that it helps bind to the toxin and makes you excrete it out through your feces. So activated charcoal does not get absorbed into your systemic circulation. So as a quick review of your GI system, let's say you accidentally drink or take a bunch of Tylenol and it goes into your uh, stomach, which then goes into your uh, intestines. Now from your intestines, your body naturally would absorb that into your blood. And when, for example, a lot of Tylenol gets into your blood and it's over the recommended amount, it could cause an overdose or a toxicity. So what activated charcoal is trying to do is it's trying to prevent that Tylenol from going past your small intestine into your bloodstream. So it never, so activated charcoal doesn't really get absorbed into your blood or your systemic circulation. Knowing that it's very effective in treating um, overdoses on certain types of medications or other substances, but um, does it make sense of it being good for cleansing your body of toxins? In my opinion, no, because if it doesn't get absorbed into your systemic circulation, how does it help cleanse your liver or how does it help like cleanse your overall body? Now I get that maybe if you eat something and you don't want to get absorbed into your bloodstream, you might want to take it, but that's you have to take it within that hour like we talked about, because if you take it maybe the next day, Activate charcoal is just going to go straight through you and it's not really going to get into your uh, blood, which is not going to really do anything. So I don't know if I'm missing anything in, the, in regards of how it is very good holistically, of how it's good um, overall for your cleansing your body of toxins, because if it doesn't get into your body, it doesn't really do anything. So maybe I'm missing something. If I am, um, leave a comment in the, in the comment section below. Maybe I missed a concept of how it might help. But in my opinion, um, it's strictly used for poison treatment. Moving forward, let's talk about some counseling points for activated charcoal. First and foremost, the capsule formulation is not effective for poison treatment. You want to use the suspension or the powder formulations. Also, when you're taking activated charcoal, you want to uh, expect a black kind of tarry stool because that's how the medication works. If it doesn't get absorbed in your systemic circulation, it's going to go straight through you. And since the nature of the medication is black, you'll expect a black tarry stool. Also, um, like I mentioned earlier, the poison control hotline will typically give you a dosing recommendation based on like um, the situation of how much was ingested or um, certain types of overdoses with very different types of toxins. But a general rule of thumb is that the typical dosing for activated charcoal is one gram per kilogram. Um, so it's weight based dosing. So if someone weighs, for example, 100 kilograms, they'll take 100 grams of activated charcoal. Um, to help treat their poison overdose. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and learned something new. If you guys did, please give me a big thumbs up and make sure you comment any questions or feedback you guys have for me. Until then, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.